evening is the kingdom of astrophiles. Twinkling stars always attract the mind of astronomy lovers. Jupiter is twinkling next to the moon. And I started my observations as usual. Switched on my little guy. Entered the details. He is locating the target automatically. Today we are going to observe planet Jupiter. Jupiter is the fifth planet from the Sun and the largest in the solar system. It's a gas giant with a mass more than two and a half times that of all the other planets in the solar system combined, but slightly less than one thousandth the mass of the Sun. Jupiter has 80 known moons and possibly many more, including the four large moons discovered by Galileo Galilei in 1610, Io, Europa, Ganymede and Callisto. Aya and Europa are about the size of Earth's moon, Callisto is almost the size of the planet Mercury, and Ganymede is larger. It has a slight but noticeable bulge around the equator. The outer atmosphere is divided into a series of latitudinal bands, with turbulence and storms along their interacting boundaries. A prominent result of this is the Great Red Spot, a giant storm which has been observed since at least 1831. This is how Jupiter was observed by my telescope, 12 mm eyepiece and mobile phone. Then I put Svoni SV-105 planetary camera on. Open SharpCap software. And connected the cables to the camera and to the laptop. I got a video of Jupiter with the Svoni camera. Then I stacked the video with AutoStackit software. Then I turned the details up using Registax 6 software. I was able to win the second and third places at Astrophilia International Astrophotography Competition with this photo. This is the latest photo of Jupiter captured by James Webb Space Telescope of NASA. And this is how the Hubble Space Telescope observed Jupiter. Now let's study some.
Interesting facts about Jupiter. This is an image of Jupiter captured while auroras are happening. This is the size of Jupiter compared to other planets. And this is the size of great red spot on Jupiter compared with the Earth. Jupiter is the fastest spinning planet in the solar system. For all its size and mass, Jupiter sure moves quickly. In fact, with a rotational velocity of 12.6 kilometers per second tilde 7 point for 5 meters per second or 45 300 kilometers per hour 28148 miles per hour the planet only takes about 10 hours to complete a full rotation on its axis Jupiter has rings when people think of ring systems Saturn naturally comes to mind but in truth both Uranus and Jupiter have ring systems of their own Jupiters were the third set to be discovered after the other two, due to the fact that they are particularly faint. The Galileo spacecraft was the first to have entered orbit around Jupiter, arriving in 1995 and studying the planet until 2003. Can we land on Jupiter? No. Jupiter is made of mostly hydrogen and helium gas. So, trying to land on it would be like trying to land on a cloud here on Earth. There's no outer crust to break your fall on Jupiter. Just an endless stretch of atmosphere. In 2016, astronomers have captured video evidence of a collision between Jupiter and a small celestial object, likely a comet or asteroid. Comet Shoemaker or Levy 9 collided with Jupiter over a 5.6 day period in July 1994. The first of 21 comet fragments hit Jupiter on July 16, 1994 and the last on July 22, 1994. The 21 major fragments were denoted A through W in order of impact, with letters I and O not used. These days, you can observe the Jupiter just after the sun set in the eastern sky. It's like a bright star, so you can identity easily. Hope you guys studied many things on Jupiter in this video. Let's meet with another interesting video soon.